Okay, check this out. It's a spiritual battle. Powers and principalities. I'm sitting down with Mike Decker in his backyard. We're talking about a couple of things. And I turned my chair slightly and noticed this object in the sky that I've never seen before. So Mike grabs his P900. I grab my P1000. And I couldn't get a bit, I couldn't get a beat on it, even though I was the one that saw it. But Mike did. We clocked this thing for quite a while. Mike caught this amount of video on it, but it was really tough to videotape. But it was triangular. It was not metallic. It was spinning around. And it was very tough to focus on for the camera, strangely enough. But you can see that. See that? See that? Let me see if I can pause it. You see that? You see that? It's not a bag. It's not a balloon. Because we both videotaped those. And this is way up in the cloud area. So it's high. You see that? I'm trying to pause it. You see that? Just pay attention because we're gonna it's gonna get worse. And then it was gone. And then it came back. And then it entirely disappeared. Totally disappeared. Even though I'm watching it with binoculars and we've got two cameras trained on it. Disappeared entirely. Then, at the exact same time, a YouTuber or a, a subscriber, I should say sent me this video. He's in Las Vegas. And as you can see, Vegas is totally shut down. There's nobody there. They're in lockdown. There are police officers guarding the casinos. But meanwhile, the Luxor is running their beam into the sky. Nobody's on the streets. They're in an entire lockdown. Do you notice anything crazy inside the beam? This guy's using a camcorder, I would believe, because he does zoom in on it. But there are entities. These aren't birds, these aren't butterflies, these aren't moths drawn to, to, to the light. This entire place is locked down, but the Luxor has got its beam going straight up in the sky. And these entities look incredibly similar to what we just saw the same day over Wyoming. That's it. Yeah, those aren't birds, those aren't bees. I don't know what that is. But I'll tell you what, if you live near the Pyramid in Tennessee, if you live near One World Trade Center, pay attention to these things at night. See if they are lighting up. Because we never knew what the pyramids were, correct? And meanwhile, we're watching the New World Order make their move. Are they indeed using these pyramids as these pyramids were always designed to draw down fallen angels or lowercase g gods or other entities? I just find the timing unbelievable. We're in the middle of a massive, man-eating, murderous pandemic that's killing everyone. And yet the Luxor is running their beam and it's full of crazy... I've, I've seen hundreds of people do videos on this thing in the sky. I've never once seen this. Do you see what I'm saying? This is totally, incredibly insane to me. And it looks very similar to the strange object we saw the same day over Wyoming, which isn't all that far away from Nevada. And as you can see, there's nobody on the streets. Why does the video suck so much? I don't know, man. I don't know. It's how it came up. Doing the best I can here. I got a lot of information coming through at one time. And I expect to be shut down very soon online and on Earth. So I'm doing the best I can here, people. This is crazy, right? Totally crazy. But I don't know what these things are. That is crazy. Whatever those, I mean, look at that. Those aren't birds. Those aren't anything other than small star looking illuminaries, orbs or whatever. If you can get over there and keep an eye on this place or any other place that likes to shoot a beam in the sky to entertain the sheeple, do so. Vegas is entirely shut down, yet this is going on when nobody's looking? That's insane to me. Leave it in the comments, or don't. I'm out.